Today we're gonna talk about melee weapons for two different things. The one you'll use to get a kill and the one you'll use to speed boost. You may not know this but melee weapons don't have the same stats in general and mostly the interesting stats will be race time which we can define in two ways. The full race if you want to use it to take down an enemy or the minimum race time needed to be able to drop it right after which is interesting for speed boosting. The range because it can vary from one melee weapon to another, the hit registration delay, self-explanatory, and lastly what we can call fire rate or swing rate. If you want a melee weapon to get kills, you'll need something that has a short hit registration delay with long range and if possible a fast fire rate. You can choose from the boxing gloves, the cali stick, the glow stick, the folding knife, the karambit, the butterfly knife, the knife, and base knife. All these melee weapons have one thing in common. If you hold the firing button, you'll get two shots, which will give you more chances to get the kill. To add to that, all these melee weapons have great hit registration delay and a pretty low full race time, so it'll be pretty easy to pull them out and kill someone without having to tap on the shoot button earlier. Other melee weapons like the katana or the nunchucks can also be used, but they can only shoot or swing ones. What about the best melee weapon to speed boost? We talked about these in a previous video, but I'm gonna give you more explanation so you can decide side knowing all their pros and cons. So the speed boost with a sniper, since you'll mainly use your melee with a sniper, you raise your melee weapon and during the animation you tap on the switch button to drop it and go back to your sniper. As you're pulling out your melee weapon you'll already start running faster, up to 7.26 meters per second which is the sprint speed for every single melee weapon. And the question here isn't which one has the fastest race time, but which one can you raise and drop faster? What's really important to us is how quick you can start dropping your melee and how long is the drop time. First of of all, there are two melee weapons that you don't want to use for speed boost the bat and the axe. They are way too slow to drop which will put you in a huge disadvantage if you're trying to speed boost with those. The base melee and the classic knife take a lot of time to raise so they aren't that good to use. Same for the glow stick, the ice axe and the sickle. The wrench, the cali sticks and the nunchucks are slightly faster to raise but they are still not as fast as the following ones. The boxing gloves were used a lot at some point because they didn't produce any sound while pulled out which isn't the case anymore so using them for that purpose in SND for example isn't a better choice. The karambit, the folding knife and the butterfly knife are three really good choices even if they aren't the fastest plus when you use them you'll gain some style points. Slightly faster than those we have the machete, it's faster to drop but slightly slower to raise which for a raise and drop movement will be even but if you're running with your machete in hand and suddenly you have to drop it to take your main weapon it'll be faster with 283 milliseconds instead of 317 milliseconds for the karambit and the folding knife. Then we have the shovel which has the second fastest drop time with 267 milliseconds but the race time is slower and for a race plus drop movement it'll be slower than the machete but it deserves a mention. So which one's the best? It's the assault knife. Its full raise time is 1033 milliseconds which is the third slowest but as I said earlier that's not too important since you won't fully raise your melee when speed boosting and for this it's the fastest one. It also has the fastest drop time with 200 milliseconds which compared with more usual stats is faster than the best time to go possible with the CBR4 which is 225 milliseconds. And it's also a good melee weapon you can use to get kills because it has great range and registration delay but a pretty slow fire rate which is why I I don't recommend it for that purpose specifically. If you watch some sniping highlights you might have noticed that some people tend to use the katana. Well it's not that slow to raise and drop but compared to an assault knife it's pretty slow. We could rank the katana just slightly behind the karambit, the folding knife and the butterfly knife. Compared to those three it can shoot twice if you hold the firing button but personally it's not what we would pick. What's your favorite melee weapon? Let me know down in the comments below. If you want to master sniper movement since you know now what melee to use with your sniper, check this video right here. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.